The best thing about playing on stage in any kind of gig is the moment when you when, when I'm not singing, you get the chance to look up and see the crowd. Guitar Hero, they, they sort of put you in these venues with all the crowd there, so it's nice to get the chance of what it feels like to be on stage, because I think it's the best, uh, best feeling in the world, so I think hopefully, hopefully people can uh, get the chance to feel what it's like to be in a band, basically. I'm excited to be in a game because I've never been in a computer game before. No one else moves the way he does, so what we want to do is make his performance in the game as authentic as possible. We put Matt in a suit, he's got sensors all over him, there's a whole range of cameras all around us that pick up all the data, then that is how Matt's character is going to move in the game. I was trying to remember uh, some of the gigs that I've done when I remember playing, playing Plug-In Baby, so, uh, so I was just sort of trying to close my eyes and just imagine I was on stage at Glastonbury or something. The key is to try and mimic all the movements that I'm doing, otherwise it's not going to work. You've got to spin around and jump as much as you can, and then, then you might get somewhere. <laughs> Games like Guitar Hero give people a totally new way of uh, discovering bands they would otherwise probably not come across, you know. Um, there's, there's definitely, I think, a lot of people out there that play games and buy games in the way that people used to buy records, you know, uh, back in the 80s or 70s or whatever. So I think it's, uh, so, yeah, it's great to, to expose people to new music.